Ah, oh, Twilight Town. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey, what's up? It's been a long time since anyone's come from outside. You've come from far away. Yeah, those close to you, I'm pretty sure you guys must be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurers? Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? A bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me. Oh, gee whiz, I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear, and scary to tell, too. Oh no, the bell rang. Oh, this is awful. Who could it be now? Link, link. Whoa, that was the craziest thing I've ever seen. What's going on in this weird town? Who knows, man? Oh, badness. Now poor Gloomer got turned into a pig. Now I see why it's called the pigs. The bell tolls or whatever. <laughs> These pigs, man. Who are you, Gramps? I'm the mayor of this poor town. Some call me Dower. Dower? Dower. Yeah, because it's spelled like hour with a D. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? I played Grandia. Yes, that's true. It's like my second favorite game of all time. This isn't the place for telling the tales of sadly. Come, come to my house. Yeah, okay. By the way, I got a list of star pieces. <laughs> because I'm probably just gonna like, at this point... During, uh, when I was getting stuff off screen, I thought to myself, Oh, wouldn't it just be nice to try to get as many star pieces and shine, shine sprites during the stream as possible? So, I have a guide up, officially. So we can find most, if not all of them. My traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I'd like to welcome you. But welcoming people is generally a good thing, and it's nothing but bad here. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Whoa, cursed? Yes, cursed. That's the right word, right? Yes, of course it is, you see. Beyond town is a forest, and in it is an ancient building, the Creepy Steeple. The dark creature who lives there? Its curse ordains that when the steeple bell rings. One of the Twilighters living here in the village becomes a pig. Will my loved ones become a swan? Will I too become a curly-tailed oinker? I'm so worried I can't sleep at night. Of course, night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. It doesn't have to be seen as a negative thing, though. Let me give you some advice. Advice. Oh, hiccups. Leave us. Leave before you two get pigified. Not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something really important. Maybe you've heard of it. It's a star-shaped rock called the Crystal Star. Uh, I don't know anything about the Crystal Star. But in Creepy Steeple, there's a glittery red stone shaped like a star. Whoa, you serious? That's gotta be the Crystal Star. It's gotta be. Uh, you people, you aren't thinking of going to the Creepy Seeple, are you? Grrr, unthinkable! Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, there's a star piece back here. Yeah, like, look at that. They do a lot of these star pieces where you can just walk over and find them, but there's no way you'd ever see them. It's basically like, hey, explore every nook and cranny and you'll find them. They do a lot of that. Should be another one around here. One of these bushes. What? Back here? Somewhere. I'll save point. Woohoo! You know what? Let's use Goombella for a bit. We got her powered up. We can actually switch to her. We haven't used Goombella in so long because she hasn't gotten powered up. But now everyone's powered up at least once. And one more Shine Spray, we can level up someone to rank 2. Assuming there is a rank 2. I would assume there is. I would assume there's like 3 ranks with how long this game is going to be. What's over this way? Is this uh, another screen? Woohoo! 
Fine. We'll do some tattling. It's a local Twilighter. Are you all these people wearing major eyeliner or what? Ah, oh, maybe it's like a local fashion thing. Didn't they get the memo that goth is out? Oh, Goombella. Goombella's ability is like cool, but it's also like forgettable because like all the other abilities help with like, you know, dungeon traversal. Goombella's is just like, oh yeah, find out more lore on NPCs and stuff, which is cool, but it's also like the most forgettable one. You tend to forget about it a lot. You just don't really use it other than like if you're filling the tattle log. Oh, okay. I'm <laughs> rejected. A dang pipe. That must be to the creepy steeple. It's a novelist who lives in Twilight Town. I wonder what kind of novels he writes. I can't believe people actually read in this town. The light would kill my eyes. Yes, I'm a novelist, and I read several books a day. Not all pop-up books, either. I wonder if pigs can read. I'm a bit concerned about it, too, to be honest. Woohoo. And break these pumpkins. <laughs> Who's back here? Oh, it's a bird. It's a crow. Caw, caw! I know starlight pieces here. What's up? A nasty monster lives in the woods past here. I'm serious. That's what somebody says. If you still want to go through even after hearing that, you need the mayor's permission. Ha! We heard that one before. Nasty monster, please. Oh, whatever. Gate guy. Let's go ask Mario. Let's go ask Mario. All right. Didn't we just talk to the mayor? Couldn't he have gave us permission before we had to come here and find out we need permission? Oh, okay. This has to happen. Oh, the bell rang, Mario. That means someone's gonna... Ooh, at least it's not me this time. It's the mayor's house. Hey, you don't think this pig is the mayor, do you? What do we do now? We can't get his permission to pass through the gate now. That's unfortunate. There's the star piece. I must have not hit that specific bush. What do we at now? 16? Not bad. So I guess now I go back to this gate. What? The mayor's a pig? Oh no, what do we do? Govern ourselves! Well, there's just no way I can let you through now. It's martial law time. Just forget about it. It's okay. got turned into a pig. At this rate, they'll all be pigs soon. And then maybe even us. No way! No way, Jose. A gatekeeper. Also used to be a twilight there there's something strange about it that's the gatekeeper of twilight town there's a guy like this in every town if there weren't you'd go wherever you want and beat the game so fast <laughs> never mind let's never speak of it yeah they call that padding goombella this is how rpgs pad not every rpg has sufficient padding but most do in some way not always bad what the mayor's a pig oh no what do we do govern ourselves Okay, what am I supposed to do now, though? 
I've been thinking lately if I'm gonna turn into a big, I'm gonna be a big one. Cause what's the point in being a pipsqueak pig, right? Gotta embrace the pigginess. I am lost. Yeah, I've been rejected. I'm very, very sad. Yeah, I'm a novelist, yada yada. Oops. Actually, wait, did I buy anything in here? This is a shop, right? Oh, there's like nothing in here for some reason. What's up? Oh, customer. Sorry, we're not open right now. Huh? Why am I crying? My husband's been turned into a pig. A pig. My husband went to the woods yesterday to collect herbs, but no husband came home. Instead, the pig returned. This pig. We got into a fight before you left, and I had called him a chauvinist pig. And now he really is a pig. He has a sweet side, too, like cooking my favorite food on my birthday, you know? And when shoppers get rude, my husband escorts them out. Why is this auto scrolling? I wish you wouldn't dip into the cola money. Oh, okay, this is. Okay. Okay, there's a point to this. Yeah. So, uh, are you even listening? So, hey, could you figure out some way to restore my husband to normal? I'll do whatever I can to help. You can even take whatever you want from the storeroom if it might help, you know? Okay. This is locked, though. What's that? The storeroom is locked. My husband must have taken the key with him, lost in the woods. And lost it in the woods. Words. You're a pig! I guess now we have no choice, now we can pass through. Huh? The gatekeeper's gone. No, not gone. He turned into a pig. Well, not to be insensitive, but that works for, out for us. We could just cruise through. Yeah, Goombella, let's get it. Twilight Trail. Give me some enemy encounters. By the way, you can sometimes hit trees and star pieces fall out. I learned that when collecting star pieces. Hello, poison Goombas. I failed that. I forgot how the hammer works for a split second. Oh, this music. Something I do appreciate about this game is having different music. Like, the battle theme is the same, but different remixes per area. That's really cool. Alright, bad multi bonk. Plus six attack? What the heck, dude? That's a bit overkill. Now I just need to kill you. That one's invisible, though. All right, don't fail this time, Nova. There you go. <laughs> Get frozen. Oh, until you can do the thing you could do with uh, Mario. Put in Yoshi. Oh. There's a Goomba attacking me. normal hammer here. What's this do? Go away, the enemies to shrink them. Oh, it hits everything. Okay, I don't really need it right now, though. Die, Goomba. Easy. Excuse me, Mr. Goomba. You're literally an iceberg. So what was the special move we got? Temporarily increases your party's attack and defense power. That that could be a good buff to use at times. Now die. Mario's coming to murder you. Nice. Oh my word, so many coins. What the heck? I'm gonna try to, like, break all this so I can look for star pieces. Hello. Thanks for the super mushroom. No, come here. Nice. Why 
the way, I heard this game, I didn't know this at the time, I heard this game, uh, this is running at 30 FPS while the original ran at 60 FP FPS, which is literally a Symphonia issue. Or not a Symphonia issue, it's like very Symphonia-esque where they reduce the frame rate. I didn't know that at the time. Also, I can't really tell though because I never played the original. So, I mean, of course I wouldn't be able to tell, but I just thought that was interesting. Because that's like a lot of people's issue with this remake and like oh why did they make it a 30 fps instead of 60 fps and it is kind of baffling yeah yeah, yeah bubble your bubble means nothing to me goodbye i do love that bingo time that's not the mushroom i needed game Oh, this is literally an Earth Tremor, by the way. Get him, Yoshi. Oh, and they could shrink enemies. That's neat. Yoshi Kid is best partner? Confirmed. Hello. This is a good spin hammer opportunity. Yeah. Putting Coops. Coops is the only one that can actually like do damage without jumping. Like no FP damage. Defense by three, not bad. Don't really need defense here, but still appreciated. Our power's not boosted. Attack power's not boosted. No more attack buffs. Hang on, I'm getting two separate tabs up. So I can have one for Star Piece and one for Shine Sprite. Oh, I deserve that, to be honest. Hammer time. Get him, Coops. And his very soul. coins we should definitely buy stuff at the shop probably should have been rogue port but you know i would have bought stuff in twilight town if they actually had stuff give me a super mushroom also a honey syrup we also have a couple of stuff in the stash not too much though oh hello i see you've been pigified uh what do i have to use an ability here Oh, maybe blow this away with, uh, what's-her-face. Hmm, okay. Doesn't really leave me with many options, does it? You know what? Yeah, I was gonna say you could definitely reach that. Got the shop key, so I guess now we have to use that shop key. We can't do anything about that tree yet. Also, these ink coupons, I should probably use one. Kinda makes that mushroom I used a waste though, but eh, it's fine. You got the normal Yoshi? I always try to get red or orange. I think it's cool that there's other Yoshis. I probably would have tried getting other Yoshis if I knew how to... Well, I know how to do it now. People in my Discord were talking about it. 
But I had already gotten the green Yoshi, and I was just like, I'll settle for this. I think it's cool, though, that there are different Yoshi colors in the game. I didn't really know how to do it at the time, and I was just like, yeah, I'll stick with this. I don't really care. It's just a cosmetic change, but I think it's kind of cool. I think other Yoshis is awesome. Yo, Bushi. Jam and jelly. Oh, it's a curse. We need a curse to get past that tree. What up? Vents Plus is interesting. We're definitely getting BP at the next level up. Hold up, hey, who's there? I just heard a voice. It's another curse. There's no way that people could be here. Seriously, it's so unlikely. Huh? What's that you say? You've seen a chest like this before? Get out of here. No, no, no. I'm not like those chests, I promise. Look at my eyes. Tell me I'm lying. I'm not. Seriously, just get me out of here. You'll see. Don't make me beg. What? Come on. You know how ridiculous you sound right now. I'm laughing in here. You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you. Well, I did plan on doing something to you, but it's not so much a curse as, uh, well, a wonderful new ability that will allow you to go special places. That's what they all say. Curse is actually good in this game. Doesn't that sound nice? Oh, come on, please. Just find this key and open the chest. I know it's near this town somewhere. I just can't look for it myself because I'm in here. Pretty neat. Pretty pretty please words. 